Mr. Beast has become the real life Willy Wonka and he's hiding 10 golden tickets in 10 random chocolate bars. And for a chance to be in one of his videos, I'm gonna buy 10,000 Mr. Beast chocolate bars. But wait, we already have an issue. You can only buy 21 boxes of the variety pack. How am I supposed to get 10,000 bars? Right away, things seemed impossible, but then I got an idea. This is Jim. He's our money guy. Jim, I need you to find me 26 people on Craigslist so they can buy me Mr. Beast chocolate. On it. One week later, it was time to pick up the chocolate. Now that we have the chocolate, time to find the golden ticket. Now, I've always been the unluckiest guy ever, but maybe after buying this many chocolate bars, I'll finally win something. All right, guys, first spin of the day. Come on, can I win something? Let's go, come on! No! Okay, it looks like we're already off to a bad start. How this works is simple. Each Mr. Beast bar has a code that lets you spin for a prize. Happy Mr. Beast equals a win, and crying Mr. Beast is a loss. We haven't won anything, but at least the chocolate's good. Now it's time for us to open as many chocolate bars as possible. I just want a mystery video. Okay, not bad for a first prize. Jim, what are you gonna do if you win the chocolate factory? Taking my kids on a tour. Carrie, if you win the Tesla, can I drive it? No. Okay, so we've been opening bars for hours now and I've been super unlucky, but I have an idea. I wanna win, so opening chocolate bars with Mr. Beast's friends might make me luckier. And I'm also sending a tweet to Mr. Beast himself to ask if he'll open a chocolate bar with me. Preston, buddy, you free? I'm coming over with some Mr. Beast bars. I love chocolate, come on over. Perfect, see you soon. This is Preston, one of the biggest YouTubers in the world and friends with Mr. Beast. Preston's office. Hello, sir. Ah, oh, thank you. I bring chocolate for you. And you brought the sun. <laughs> come on in. Couple of Beast bars. He should have called it the Beast bars. I really would have appreciated that name more. This is the winner, though. Yeah, I can already feel it. Oh, oh spin, spin to win, win sir. Oh, you won. You've won a mystery video for <laughs> this. <laughs> Dude. That's the price. Thanks, I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> would you rather win the Tesla or would you rather win the chance for the chocolate factory? Chance for the chocolate factory. But what if you lose? You just end up with nothing. Well, I won't lose. Fair. Even with the Preston's overwhelming amount of confidence, we weren't winning a single thing. This is our final bar. What do you got? <laughs> <laughs> You brought me busted bars, Dylan. I'm sorry. Get out of my office. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm gonna just cradle you. Okay, bye. Sadly, Preston didn't change my luck at all, but I still have some extra bars to give away to his team. Whoa, you got something. I won. It's a freaking video. <laughs> it's a BTS video. Meanwhile, while I was at Preston's, it looked like nobody won anything at the warehouse and we were all out of codes for the day. Yesterday, we opened hundreds of bars and won nothing, but we're switching it up today to get lucky. We got Mr. Beast, man! Let's go! Now, while you guys open chocolate bars, I have a place to be. Where is he even going? While my friends stayed back to open chocolate, I flew to Colorado to visit my friend, Matthew Beam. He built the world's largest Mr. Beast bar, and he might give me another chance to win. But we have another problem. There's a huge winter storm in the Rocky Mountains right now, and our flight is delayed. Matthew is supposed to fly to the UK tonight, and if I get there too late, I'll miss him completely. If I don't catch him in time, this is gonna suck. Luckily, after only being delayed for 20 minutes, I made it on the flight, and we were off to Matthew. Sir, What's good, Chief? How you I doing? bring chocolate. This is the only thing I brought on my flight. No way. All right, Matthew, here is all the chocolate I brought. Wow. And we are just gonna open as many of these as we can, and hopefully one of us cops a dub. Here we go. You didn't win this time. My first spin of the day, nothing. For the next few hours, Matthew and I scan some codes. Yes! No. Congratulations, you won a Mr. Beast merch bundle. I want to be the one to win. And even though he won, I still didn't win a single thing. Meanwhile, everyone back home had a change of luck and they started winning too. Yeah, winner, baby. You want a code for $10 off a Feastables bundle. I got it. What? I won. Yeah, I won. Yeah, I won. Road to success. Even our editing team won stuff. I won $5 off of Mr. Beast Burger. And with the codes they racked up, the team ordered Mr. Beast Burger. They even gave the delivery guy some chocolate. It's Beast Burger time. This is my first time eating a Beast Burger and it's pretty good. So we just opened up all of this Mr. Beast chocolate and this is the last one. Come on, what is it? Oh, what'd you get? You won $10 <laughs> off Beast I won twice and it was on the last one. So you came here all the way to Colorado 
just to get lucky and you didn't win anything at all. I still haven't won a single thing, but I have another idea. Even though I didn't win anything with Matthew, I still have another YouTuber I can meet in Colorado. Zealous. Zealous won the Mr. Beast YouTuber challenge, so he might be the luckiest guy there is, and luckily he only lives 30 minutes away. I don't have too much time to open these with Zealous, but hopefully the one I open is the winning ticket. Zealous, I come bringing gifts. Oh I come bringing you chocolate. Should I make you late for your flight? This guy. He's gonna win something and I'm gonna walk out of Colorado with nothing. Oh, come on. We gotta get we gotta get Dylan something. He's put in so much work for this video. Maybe like- This, this is your code, Dylan. If you win something, it's yours. It's not mine. Well, I mean, the least they could do is subscribe. Please, I have zero subscribers right now. Subscribe. <laughs> if he wins, I'm gonna be so mad. Dude, you're G. Thank you. I, I hope you win. I hope you get to the airport on time. I hope I win too. All right, see you, dude. All right, bye. Don't crash. I'll do my best. Sadly, I didn't win anything at Zealous, and now I'm running late for my flight. Luckily, we made it to the airport in time. Time to open the last Mr. Beast bar. Was flying out here a bus? Yes or no? Mm. Dang it! Are you serious? After a long day, I'm heading back to Texas, taking an L. The team just let me know, though, that they want a couple of Beast Burger codes today, some Feastable discounts and merch. Meanwhile, I'm still the only one that hasn't won anything. Flying home without winning anything felt horrible, and I am starting to worry now. I spent $30,000 on this video, haven't won a single thing, and Mr. Beast hasn't even seen my tweet. I'm running out of options, and things are getting worse. So we're on day three, and we have a huge issue. Someone won the first mystery ticket. And what that means is we only have nine more chances to win a mystery ticket. We have to open bars fast today. And just like that, everyone started scanning these bars as fast as they could. And luckily, some people won a few things. Hey, I want a Feasible shirt. But it still wasn't enough. Day three is officially over. No signs of anything big yet. All right, it's day four. I still haven't won anything, but maybe if I give stuff away like Mr. Beast, I'll increase my chances. So we loaded up the cars and it's time to give away some Mr. Beast chocolate bars. Are you subscribed to Mr. Beast by any chance? I'm not, no. Will you subscribe to him if I give you some chocolate? <laughs> Each of these chocolate bars contains a code. You can win a Tesla, half a million dollars. Oh Mr. Beast is the goat. Here you go. <laughs> yes. so Guys, Mr. Beast, I got you one subscriber. Let's go. Yeah, go Mr. Beast. With one person subscribing to Mr. Beast, we're off to a great start. And hopefully this will help us win the mystery ticket. So far, we've given away like 50 boxes. We got a couple hundred more to go. If you subscribe to Mr. Beast and take 10 of these boxes off my plate, I'll give you $100. Sure. Okay, cool, he subscribed to Mr. Beast. Since you subscribed to Mr. Beast, here's $100. Awesome. Now everyone loved the Mr. Beast bar and after giving away hundreds of boxes, hey, y'all know who Mr. Beast is? As long as you guys know who Mr. Beast is and you're subscribed. Take as many as you want, I don't care. Mr. Beast is gonna run the world, man. <laughs> That's my dude. Box for you, I'm like, oh boy. You can win a Mr. Beast candy bar yeah. box. Yo, why is Jim the best salesperson on campus? This is crazy. So far, we've given away all of the beach bars on campus. We got a couple more places to go though. Location two, it's still cold as balls outside. Yeah, y'all know who Mr. Beast is? Yes. Here, yep, here. Y'all wanna try one of the bars? Go ahead and open it. Yep, yep. After a full day of giving away hundreds of boxes and thousands of Mr. Beast bars, it was time to head back to the warehouse. Even after giving away all of those bars, our luck did not change. It's the end of day four, my plan didn't work, and we only have 20 boxes left for tomorrow. It's day five, there are still nine tickets remaining, this is our last chance. Mr. Beast still hasn't responded to my tweet yet, but it's fine, hopefully the mystery ticket is in one of these boxes. The last bar. And from the looks of it, only Jim won something today. I just want a Feastable shirt. I'm gonna open these by myself. Uh, if I don't win something here, I think I will officially be the unluckiest person ever. Since I'm finally down to my last box, I feel like the unluckiest guy on earth. Even after doing everything I can to change my luck these past few days, I haven't won a single thing. But then the unexpected happened. Oh my gosh, Mr. Beast DM'd me! Mr. Beast saw my tweet and wanted to open the last Mr. Beast bar I had with me. This is my chance to win. Yo. Bro, if this actually is the chocolate factory, then people are gonna think I rigged it. I'm gonna lose my mind. That would be insane. Now it's time to spin. 
No! I didn't win anything! Oh. Hey, thank you for buying uh, 10,000 bars. I love you. Thank love you too. The bars are delicious. Kidding. <laughs> <laughs> All right, see ya. <sighs> and of course, after days of doing everything I could to change my luck, opening these bars for days, opening these bars with YouTubers, and even giving thousands of them away, I'm really glad other people on the team won. However, I'm still super unlucky. But I did get to open the last bar with Mr. Beast, so maybe it was a win after all. Well, that was it for the first video on the channel. Things only get crazier from here, so please subscribe so my parents will love me. See you guys.